Hello students, welcome you to the online class of Bardwan Model School. I am Jaydeep Chatterjee here to take your EVS class for class 3. First of all, take out your book. Uh, your book is this NCRT, prescribed by NCRT book, looking around. Okay. Let us uh, first open the chapter 1. All of you must open chapter 1. Uh, chapter 1 is Punam's Day Out. I have written there Punam's Day Out. This is page number 1. So, you must have your book with you. You must follow what I am uh, reading and explaining. First, see here. Uh, Ma, please let me go to school today. I have been at home for the past two days. I am getting bored, said Punam. So, this is uh, this thing is telling uh, told by Punam to her mother. But you still have fever. Go outside and lie down on the cot, replied Ma. Punam fell asleep on the cot. Cot is a bit of mattress where. Uh, you can sleep there. Suddenly, something fell on her face. Punam woke up at once and touched her cheek. Oh no, whose mischief is this? Is it the crows or the pigeons? She is asking. She is thinking of that. Is it crows or the pigeons? It seems it is the crows. See the picture here, a very fine, funny picture here, and the leaves. That means this is a tree where these animals used to live there okay this is a pigeon one is pigeon squirrel this is the uh, this is this is the uh, crow this is the monkey and many types of birds are there butterflies are there these animals that lives on the trees okay turn to next page punam then punam looked up as he saw some animals on the tree which animals can you spot on the tree in the picture? Write down their names. You must see the picture again and write down the names. Some of the name of the animals I am writing here. Name of the animals. Name of the animals. What I have seen? I can see. I have seen monkey there. Okay, then number two, pigeon, number three, crow, number four, butterfly, and so on. Okay, and so on, you write all the names there. Then again go to page number 2 there. Punam picked up a leaf from the ground. So, Punam picked up the leaf from the ground and wiped her cheek with it. And it, her, it, uh, she wiped her cheek with the leaf. But her cheek was still sticky. She thought, let me go and wash my face in the nearby pond. Then she thought, that as it is, uh, he she could not uh, wipe it properly, so she should wash uh, her face, and for that she should go to the nearby pond. See the picture of the pond there. There she saw many animals. See the she is washing her hand. Very interesting picture. Which animals did Punam see at the pond? Which animals? Did Punam see at the pond? See here, you can write their names. I am writing name of the animals. Again, this is uh, for page number 1. Okay, And this is for page number name of animals. This is name of animals uh, seen at the Pond. Okay. Uh, pond. Write the names. I am writing. 
uh, number one that I can see here goat number two that tortoise I can write number three buffalo number four frog number five number five number five is I can write crane there and six head on these two birds okay then uh, after that uh, see you can write there then uh, you go to the next page that is page number three can you act like the animal seen at the pond which animal makes what kind of sound and movements try to make similar sound okay then different animals move in different ways to go from one place to another some animals walk some crawl some fly and some swim for this some animals use their feet some use their wings some animals even take the help of their tail okay you must have seen many animals too right which of them can fly actually uh, you should do this work at home can fly i can write it here i can write it here can fly this is from page number three can fly see here can fly example you can write uh, i can write fly butterfly Achha. pigeon any bird then parrot i can write can crawl next is number 2 can crawl crawl name of the animals is uh, lizard i can tell number 2 snail then tortoise next is can walk can walk uh, walk any animal you can write can walk there cow ox deer you can write there okay can hop how animals that can hop frog i must write it here can hop number 4 can hop frog kangaroo rabbit frog kangaroo rabbit okay okay then number 5 have pigeons have wings they have wings some animals having wings they are animals that have wings have wings pigeon pigeon 
any type of bird sparrow i can write crow okay then acha this is this is uh, different answer okay this is different okay i am writing here this is from page number 3 then have fit have fit cow goat bear have tail have tail monkey cow buffalo okay so i think you will write this one animals live in different places some animals live in trees some in water some live on land some live under the ground and some fly in the sky some animals even live in our houses turn to next page look at the pictures given below color the animals that do not live in your that do not live in your house see this picture you your work is you color this picture you will do this one at home then here next page page number 5 here are some incomplete pictures of animals complete them and write their names below so if you have to complete this one and you have to write the names below okay so uh, this discussion uh, this question uh, once uh, so we have seen punam's day out we have seen many animals uh, so up to you revise this one and you do that homework as coloring for page number 4 and 5 okay thank you for your class